Kutch is famous for its white sand desert. But did you know that it is also home to some of the quaintest musical instruments? We took a journey to find out more. Kutch. Its stark beauty is mesmerizing, as is the love of color of its people. Travel through Kutch and you will find art everywhere. In the clothes, in the walls, and even in the unique musical instruments that you will find here. Around 45 tribes call Kutch their home and each have their unique signature best reflected in the many kinds of embroideries this region is known for. Interestingly, most of these tribes settled in the region only over the last hundred odd years. Until then, they were nomads, traversing through Sindh in Pakistan, the deserts of Rajasthan and Kutch. No wonder then that this region has so much in common. For instance, the making of the Ajra cloth. The tribes of Kutch also have some very unique musical instruments. In fact, in this land, music is at the very heart of its culture and the quaint instruments here reflect a unique confluence of cultures. Take for instance the colourful Sorando. Usman Jat is the only musician who still plays it. Originally from Sindh, Usman explains how Sorando is an intrinsic part of the cattle herding community known as Maldharis. Usman, a truck driver by day, says he doesn't get to play the Sorando as often as he would like. He is keen to pass on this legacy to his son along with his 150-year-old Sorando crafted by his ancestors. Noor Muhammad is another musician who has played a crucial role in reviving the fortunes of an instrument unique to Kutch, the Jodhya Pava, an unusual double flute. He has helped make the instrument go global through performances across the world and has even worked with A.R. Rahman in the film Rockstar. Thanks to the efforts made by him and the local organizations supporting traditional musicians, today students from across the world are coming to Kutch to learn the Jodhya Pava, thus ensuring it stays alive. Another wind instrument from the Kutch region is the Murchal. Like the Surando, it too traveled to Kutch with migrant communities from Sindh. Interestingly, the strains of this instrument can be heard across Central Asia and the Middle East. It may have travelled the world, but this humble instrument is rooted to this landscape and serves some very practical purposes. It is said that the cattle recognise the unique sound of their herder's murchal and thus find their way home. One of the most popular percussion instruments of Kutch is the Dakla or the Dart. Local Maldhari pastoralists play the Dakla in temples. It is also believed that the sound of the Dark keeps off the evil eye. The musical instruments of Kutch are diverse and unique, but they all have one thing in common, their connection to the land and their role in keeping communities together. This is why it is crucial to keep these traditions alive, for they are the roots nourishing this beautiful and vibrant region.